Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's a facts and type here with a video today. Um, today I'm going to be a tutorial on how to use a basic new game called Ace of Spades and a lot of features in it involved, changing your name, all that good stuff, how to set up a server, stuff like that. So if anything new seems, if anything new, uh, you notice here, it's basically I built my own computer here. A new one I built a little while ago, haven't done a video of anything since on it. Just put Camtasia on it, a trial, and we're just going to see what's going on. And here, so basically, let's go into it. Uh, yeah. So if you don't know what Ace of Spades is, I really recommend you checking out. I'll put his channel in the description. He's a very famous uh, Minecraft YouTuber. His name's Paul Sears Ju Jr. And um, check out his channel. He does a first and second look of the game, Ace of Spades. And he basically goes, I'll give you a little clip. Hi, every up. Minecraft. This is basically what the game it's looks like. Open world sand. Y you should watch the whole video. It's 20 minutes, but it really goes into detail. And yeah. So, let's head over to the Ace of Spades website. So, Ace of Spades is basically in beta right now, 0 0.26. It's brand new, uh, basically. So, I'm going to show you how to install it, use it, everything. So, first, what you want to do is hit download a beta. And depending on what browser you're using, actually, wait, I'll say that in a sec. Let me see. Alright, so we're just still bringing me to fire, hit download. Depending on what browser you're using, it'll download. If you have, I'm using Google Chrome, so it'll be down here. It's a very small file. Uh, I think a couple megs, I don't know. So, open it up. The install. Open it up, hit run. And we're going to need the internet, but I'm, I don't want it on media fire with all these ads and whatnot. So, yeah, don't isolate it. So, here we go. Ace of Spades. Set up. Just hit next. And choose your directory. This default is perfect. Next install yes it's gonna ask for your permission if you have the uh, controls on it so if you read me um, I read it for you guys sake um, right here is basically all the controls you're gonna need for the game um, and if you want to read all this like legal stuff useless info here that's fine but yeah so first thing we're gonna do is this is going to put a shortcut on your desktop. Anytime you want to play it, open that. It'll bring up the Ace of Spades website. Pick a server. Actually, pretty nifty. So, um, yeah. I personally, it does not put a uh, thing. So, now, that's all I need. It's basically almost like a plugin in your browser. Sort of. Ugh. So, just go to Ace of Spades website. And now you can pick anyone you want. There's really not that many, as you can see. But just pick uh, actors, a lot of immature ones, your mom, stuff like that. Stupid ones, just pick one. Here's how many people are in the world. Pick one, you can play on it. Alright, then just use the controls from before. Now comes the more detailed part. I'm going to teach you how to change your name in Ace of Spades. Do basically everything. So change your resolution. So in order to do this, and then setting up the server will come later. So you're going to go to click on your start button, computer. Click on your local disk drive, or whichever one's your main one. Open it up, hit Program Files. Uh, actually, I have to use 86, I'm running 64-bit. So hit Ace of Spades. Now what you're going to do is, um, whatchamacallit? Config, where's config? Here it is, config. And now you're going to have to, depending on your system, um, as far as I know, I haven't seen any other way to do this. I think I'm the first uh, tutorial video for this. But what I did was just install this program called Take Ownership. And basically you just uh, download it. And it's just a reg file for your registry. Double click it and it'll say, are you sure want to continue? Just follow these directions and hit yes. Once you have that, you can hit your config, hit Take Ownership, and hit yes. You now have complete ownership of this. Because otherwise it won't let you save. So my name, you don't want it to be Deuce. Unless you want it to, that's your... I'm going to be called Malware Remover because that's my other channel. Um, you can change the volume and your resolution. I want to put 1920 by 1080 for me. That's what I like. So just hit save and you're done with that. So you're done with that. Um, that's basically how you change your name. And there's a bunch of stuff you can read here. The PNGs, this is for when you're aiming. Um, you can change that actually. I don't know if many people know this. But you can change it. It's going to be hard. You have to do all these calculations. You know, I'm not going to even get involved with that. I would just recommend playing the game. Unless you're into that. So that's the text it uses. But besides that, we're going to go 
Hold on, guys. I'm getting a call. Let me pause this. Alright, guys. Sorry for that. I'm back. Uh, so, yeah. So, now what we're going to do is learn how to make a server. Now, from in here, you can either put the server on your desktop, the server command. You can open that up. And, um, I don't want to isolate this. You won't have that problem. But, um, you can either, uh, copy copy and paste on your desktop but if you have windows 7 all you need to type in is uh asus spades server and it'll come up so once that's up all you have to do is click it so yeah so now when this comes up it'll say enter your max players what do you want to do oh oh gosh oh i forgot to let you know you guys need to open up your port 32887 if you don't know how to do that you have to port forward it. Type in um, how to port forward on YouTube. And um, it'll basically teach you how to port forward. Uh, it's best to use the Minecraft tutorial because that's very similar. But for Minecraft, the port you open is 25565. But for this, it's 32887. So instead of opening 25565, put uh, 32887. And you should be good. So, and you can check. Uh, is my port. I don't remember the exact website. Open. Open port check tool. Can you see me.org? This is it. What port is this? 32887. And you can hit check. And I'll let you know. Is it open? Dun 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 dun. Hmm, that's weird. Yeah, it says it's not open, but it is. Don't worry. So, hmm. Whatever. It is open, so. Uh, whatever. So sorry about that. What we're going to do is we're just going to enter our max players. How many do you want? So once you pull forward it, go back to this. Enter max players between 1 and 32. Depending on what your computer can handle and how many people you think you can host on our server. I usually put 32, but many of you just want to put 16. So, you know, I'll put 32 for the hell of it. And 32. And what do you want your server name? My server is always, so check for this. XX malware remover. XX malware remover. Uh, XX xx um youtube this is usually mine and yeah so once you have that just hit enter your server is now up so if you open up your web browser and go to the asus page thing and you hit control f on your keyboard and you search for it, xx i'll type in malware remover look mine's right at the top here xx mal i now have a server up it's as easy as that guys really easy so um yeah so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to click it and hopefully camtasia will record this and you just take green or blue g or b whatever team you want uh i usually click green but for now i don't know why i click blue i mean i usually pick blue on the why i click no oh no i don't even know all right so anyway uh, here's your controls. If you want to know everything about the game more in detail, go look at Paul Sears Jr. and he'll give you everything. So that's just a basic thing on how to install it, set up your server, basically everything. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you can see that. But um, and all you have to do is hit escape to exit. Oh, and, uh, I want to show you guys a really cool trick. Not many people know this, but um, you can't make this uh. You can't minimize the screen. So what I do is I hit Control Alt Delete, Start Task Manager, and I exit out of this. I now have the game minimized down here, and I can go back to it by just clicking that. Not many people know that. I figured it out. I don't know. All right. So yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope this tutorial helped you. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Uh, so as you can see, there's a lot of people connecting actually. Uh, if I go into the website and refresh, I just want to show you. Uh, I have 17 people in here. Yeah. So, thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.